Welcome to the review and the reveal of the new or RCA Premier Atlas 10 Pro S tablet with a detachable keyboard in all of its functions. Today, it's a 10 inch screen, 4 core processor, 16 gigabyte storage, uh, IPS um, touch screen, uh, t uh, 1280 by 800, as well as a dual camera, up to six hours uh, battery life, and the key point is, is up to six hours. Can be anywhere between two, three, four, five, or six, up to six hours, depending on your settings and also um, what you do with your tablet. I do have the Google, it does come with the Google um, 7.0, which is a Nougat, and you do have in Google Play. Um, with my tablet, I personalized it to the way I want it. Took some stuff off the old tablet and had it backed up and then transferred to this tablet. So it's set, in, it's set up to the way I, I would like it. So I had no problems with the set, it, set up. But now I'm going to go into the, um, the ports first to get that out of the way. Then we're going to go into the, the keyboard and its functionalities and everything else within that system. Looking at the back of the um, tablet, you do have the, um, the camera. You have the SD card slot. This little pinhole right here, can you really see it, is the reset button. Turn it aside. We have the mic microphone button. We have the, again, we have the SD card slot. The HDMI mini. We have the power, the DC power in. You have the, um, the micro um, USB, as well as the, your um, power your earphone jack, as well as your um, USB port. And, and then you have the HDMI and HDMI. I will do a more instruction on HDMI later. Um, I can, I got a cord. Um, you can get the cord anywhere. It depends on what you want it from. Anywhere from. Um, um, Four dollars on up to um, as much as you want. So it depends on you go to Best Buy, um, uh, your local um, Walmart, ordering offline. But you can get the HDMI port anywhere. Um, just have to look and see who has it and who doesn't have it. Then the DC cord goes right here. In the little slot it says DC, and you see it's connected because with the light, the blue light that comes on there. And also you can see that it is it's a continuing charging. You can see up there where it's, is where you can see it's charging. And even when it's full charge, it's still the light's still on. You don't you don't want to um, overcharge it. So whenever it gets to a 100%, make sure you unplug it so that way it won't mess up the battery or any type of any situation internally to the unit. Okay. Okay, we, now, now we're going to switch it to the USB um, cord, Hold, and uh, I'll show you that in a second. As you see, the um, USB cable is plugged up, and it's running to the tab tablet, and you see it's actually the light is, the light is on charging. To prove it's charging, I'm going to flip it over, flip my tablet over, and can see, you can see, that is actually charging. I don't have my um, my uh, um, my internet connected. I just want the one to use it on, and, and, and things flashes around here. But you can see it is charging um, as I speak. You can actually see where it's charging. So that means that the USB cable that's connected to the um, to the um, to the screen, it says charging and it's charging. This is a standard SU USB port. It's actually going to my tablet and from my phone. You see that my phone is charging. 
my phone is charging from this port. And also within that charging, is on the screen you can see it says uh, connected to the uh, uh, Alcatel 508-5C. To the, to, you can tap it to view the files or have it charging where I have it where it's only on charging right now. But you can actually use this as if you want to take some information from your phone onto the tablet and uh, vice versa. Again, this came with a docking keyboard and I have it backwards. So you can see the pins right here, the um, connectors right here. So I'm going to go ahead and, and dock it backwards first so I can show it as a, um, as a um, nice little tablet. You can just, it's magnetic, it's um, magnetic. So you can see where it just flipped everything back over in the, the home key. Um, and just, just put it down and use it as a regular tablet. See, you can um, leave it up here, excuse me, um, as a regular tablet. You can turn it to the side. Give me one second. Turn it to the side. Give you a tablet. I don't have it uh, fully opened. Give me one second. You can hold it, you can fold it up like this. You can take it, make it the tablet. You can have it up like this. Have the keyboard backwards and have a tablet like that. So there's many ways you can make this as a as a uh, as a um, as as your personal tablet. I have um what I'm doing I have um, my own um uh, home um what call it I have my own settings my my home page um which is a uh, uh, Bing. And um, each day is a different um, screen uh, screen saver. Each day is a different um, a page, a different picture that comes up on my home page. And I have the app, my background, the apps is running, are my personal apps as well as my um, it's called Square Launcher. So uh, I can arrange it the way any, any way I want to, go sideways. So it's a pretty nice launcher. I really enjoyed it because I can uh, group. Group my um, group my um, group them, my apps according to the way I want it. I have the different the Bibles, um, TV, um, the things I use on a regular basis. Then I have my um, Microsoft um, uh, programs. Then I have my regular programs I using do as well, such as your Bing, um, Google, different apps like that I use quite often. So it's a pretty nice launcher, and uh, again, you can you can you can either use the launcher that came with it, or you can go into the Play Store and get the launcher, and you can set it up any any way you launch want to. Um, just be careful; just get the right ones uh, suitable for your taste, because I have to set it up according to my other my old tablet. It's a pretty nice um, tablet. Pretty nice um, a system I can use. You even have you even had your mouse, your um, your your, uh, your trackpad right here. And I'm going to show you, for example, on um, on um, I wasn't a Word, which is Microsoft Word. This is an Android now tablet. I'm working on this is an Android. But I have um, things set up because uh, I'm like I do like um, the um, Microsoft uh, stuff. But I do like the since I have a lot of things on Microsoft as well as Android, and you can type. Typing is pretty good. Um, I enjoy the typing on here. Just typing some some things on here. Um, it's a pretty neat uh, keyboard. I haven't found any any sluggish. All of my key work, all the keys works and stuff. But I haven't, I haven't found anything wrong with it so far. And I, uh, hopefully, it won't. I won't either. 
But it's a nice little gadget uh, you can use on the way. But like I said, I do have a lot of things um, under uh, Microsoft and stuff like that. So that means I'll uh, go back to my home screen. You can press the home button, go instantly back to your home screen. Um, and you can go to from there to your um, from your search to your um, uh, your web page. Like I said, the sound isn't all that uh, great, but at least it does. At least you can you can you can turn up the about you can turn down you can turn up the about turn up and down the volume from the keypad as well. But like I said, it's just um, amazing. It's a quick reaction on the keypad. But like I said, the sound uh, unless you have speakers and um, uh, Wi-Fi speakers, you can use the Wi-Fi speakers against that and stuff like that. But um, like I said, the sound is pretty normal compared to my microphone to my cell phone and everything else but um like I said it's just um just amazing how um it's just amazing how this little tablet is very 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 good at what it does um the quality of sound like yes you can you may can use your um your um a booster for your headphones or anything you might have headphones or or um external speakers uh, wi-fi speakers uh if you want to loud, sound louder um, and so, like I said, it's just a, a, a cool gadget, a, good, a, cool, a cool tablet, and I do highly recommend this tablet. Um, I don't know um, if they'd be making any more because I got this off of a, um, HSN, um, HSN um, but this is the Atlas Premier um, tablet, uh, which is running in the um, 7.0 Android, which is the Nougat. Um, um, mostly out there is the Viking. The, the Premier Vikings or the um, other tablets, but this is the first um, um, tablet I have from RCA. I have had other tablets, and um, it's it's a quite nice. I like the feature where you can have a different um, functionality of a tablet, whether it's an HDMI port or um, USB port or any other ports that you have. It's a very good, uh, friendly tablet, and uh, and um, I can say each each. You no, know, every day there's something to learn. You can, you can new you learn, but this is a good tablet. Wi-Fi capabilities. Um, it's very, very, very um, um, short-ended. I mean, as in the distance you can, you can go when you're using the Wi-Fi. Unless you have a very strong Wi-Fi signal, um, it, it's, it's possibility you might have um, uh, connection issues with it, but. Um, I have uh, my mobile device that I use as my um, Wi-Fi signal, um, but um, I use my uh, Wi-Fi through my mobile de device, and so that um, it can um, it can do things that it needs to be done. But mostly, like I said, it's a good tablet. Um, to get the function done, I need. Um, uh, it's not my main um, my main um, my main computer, but. Uh, it's just um, something I need to carry with me instead of my laptop all the time. But like I said, it's just a good tablet, a very nice keyboard. Um, the functionalities, like I said, you got everything you need up there, or the um, your search, your web, your email, um, your brightness, your screenshot, your um, back and forth, um, play, um, rewind, pause, fast um, forward. Your sound mute, um, uh, the sound up or down, your screen off. Again, they, they say it's a good tablet, a nice tablet um, to have. Um, even if you do a personal things, like I said, I, I'm able to do the um, to do the um, to do the Microsoft, the Word, PowerPoint. Um, um, I do like the um, notebook, PowerPoint. Um, I do have the Word. Um, the um, uh, um, Excel uh, and, and on on this on this uh, tablet. So it, it's functionality, and this is on, and then that's through the website, uh, Microsoft website, uh, that comes on with the Android uh, apps. Um, and it had the different apps right here for the um, for the um, 
different apps right here for that belongs to um, Android. Got the TV, um, TV channels. Um, you have the different Bible apps, um, and also have the different um, um, personal um, apps for um, doing uh, work, uh, whether it be um, no uh, notebooking, um, um, publishing, whether it be the uh, Word, Excel, and different other um, things I do. On, on there, and then I have the newsstand applications, different applications that you can go into different applications. Um, go back, let me go back home. Again, you have the applications. Um, um, I have list the application either by by frequency or by name. It's one thing this launcher does. So it's a very nice launcher. And like I said, there's more to come, more to um, do on this tablet than meets the eye. But let me go back to a home screen, and uh, and it's a pretty pretty quick, quick response time. And uh, sound, like I said, is not all the best quality of sound. The the camera is not that best quality of sound. Uh, the camera, I won't won't use the camera as much, but usually it's usually for um, mostly mainly uh, watching TV shows. Uh, watching videos um, and other things on on the tablet, um, but one thing I did notice the, the screen the screen color is much more different than my uh, my regular um, computer. It's much more brighter and clearer. And like I said, like I said, they can you can turn it around to this angle, and you still can get the the sharpness. You still get the you won't get as you can still see the. Uh, the, the like the number twenty one, which is today's date. You can still see that no matter which side you turn it on. You can still see the sharpness of that of the twenty one. So so it's a pretty nice screen. Um, like I said, I did show the um, reversal that you can just take it off. There we can take it off, reverse it. And do this. You can use it as a um, tablet, like like I have right here. Use it as a tablet. Up and down, sideways. Dock it. You take it off. Undock it. Reverse it. There you go. At the back of it. But then you can turn around. One thing I like about this is that when you reverse it, you can go all the way down into the back. But but when you use the other side, you can only go but um, maybe not as far back. So uh, it's a nice little um, nice little tablet. I do recommend it um, if you can find it out there. Like I said, I did get this off of QB um, HSN, and uh, and like I said, um, you can charge it. Uh, with the uh, USB, or you can charge it with the um, with the um, the other ports um, with the DC cord. Um, but other than that, very nice to have it. Um, and uh, it's color purple because that's I didn't have blue like I like, but color purple is color, the color purple is is the next best the color that I like. So again, this is my view. This is my um, comments and suggestions. If you have any concerns, just um, hook me up, um, follow the links, and, uh, and I'll catch you later. If you have any questions on this tablet, just um, ask, uh, ask me, email me, and, um, and I'll get back with you. So anyway, um, peace out, and have a wonderful day.